<laughs> Larry from the AU Review in Australia. Hey. Nice to meet you. Um, you've worked quite a bit with Nicholas over the years, and I imagine that's how you met Ryan through through Drive. Uh, yeah, first time I met Ryan was October 2010, like two weeks before they started shooting Drive. I was in LA doing a show, and all the whole uh, Drive crew came out. You know. Obviously, that soundtrack is, you know, I mean, yeah. Bronson was brilliant as well, but obviously Stri Drive has been particularly well well regarded. And um, Ryan brings you onto this film. You know, what, what was the pitch? You know, what, what kind of got you, got you into, into, the, uh, into the doors for this film? Well, he said, do you want to do it? You know, and I was like, well, I think so. You know, I got to read the script and see if I have any ideas. Because even though I really like Ryan and um, working with him on the other projects, might not, I might, might not be the right guy for it, you know? So I read the script, I had some ideas, started sending mixtapes. And we started like uh, five months before they even started shooting. And then we just kind of, two years later, here we are, you know? And how do you feel about the final product? How, how does your vision of the music, you know, match, match, what, uh, match what's ended up on the screen? Oh, it's like almost 100% what I wanted. So that's crazy, because in film it's usually you know, there's a lot of, you have to kill a lot of babies along the way, and there's a lot of things you feel precious about, but we got most of it in the film, and it's, I feel incredible about it. Well, thank you very much for your time. Yeah, what's your name? Larry. Larry, nice to meet really you. Really nice to meet you.